Like all other Sentinel satellites, Sentinel-5P is part of the Copernicus program. This program is a collaboration between the European Space Agency, ESA, and the European Commission. It's the most ambitious Earth observation program worldwide. Sentinel-5P is the first atmospheric chemistry mission within Copernicus. Its main instrument is a state-of-the-art spectrometer called TROPOMI, which will be used to detect trace gases in our atmosphere. With Sentinel-5P and TROPOMI, Copernicus will dramatically improve operational atmospheric services. There are two major operational services that are operated by the European Commission. One is called CAMS, Copernicus Atmospheric Monitoring Service. They are using data assimilation to, and they will include Sentinel-5P data and they will provide the possibility to do forecasting on special events, for example, on air quality. Another uh, important so service that is uh, operated by the European uh, Commission or financed by the European Commission is uh, the uh, uh, Copernicus Climate uh, um, Change Monitoring Service, uh, C3S. And uh, here, uh, uh, Central 5P data can contribute to the establishment of long-term data sets, making the link to previous missions like Gomez, Kiyamaki and Omi in order to provide uh, data that can be used uh, to learn about climate change. After ERS and Envisat stopped working, there was a need to fill the gap on observing air quality and air pollution. Furthermore, according to the World Health Organization, air pollution is responsible for over 3.7 million premature deaths worldwide every year. However, the health costs are even greater, as many people suffer from non-lethal afflictions caused or aggravated by breathing polluted air. Another major health concern on which Sentinel-5P is gathering data is the ozone in our atmosphere. When the ozone in our atmosphere depletes, ultraviolet light from the sun is no longer filtered. Increased exposure to UV light can cause skin cancer, immune system damage and other ailments for humans. Hence the importance of Sentinel-5P data. The tropomi data uh, will be used uh, operationally so it will be used to uh, improve the air quality forecasts. And air quality forecasts uh, are of course important uh, for uh, people who are vulnerable to uh, pollution, uh, but also uh, for the general public uh, in case of uh, big smog events. Um, what we can do with the tropomi data is we can look at the emissions of pollutants. Uh, and uh, when you see them changing over time, uh, that is very important because we can see if certain policy measures uh, have the right impact or where we see still increases and still have to do uh, more to uh, reduce uh, the uh, uh, polluting emissions. In the early 2020s, the space component of the Copernicus Atmospheric Services will be extended with the addition of the Sentinel-4 and 5 missions. Sentinel-4 will be a geostationary mission, whereas Sentinel-5 will be a low polar orbiting mission like Sentinel-5P. Atmospheric services are part of the Copernicus portfolio, which comprises six main themes. Marine, land, emergency, security, climate and atmosphere, giving a complete view on our planet's health and its evolutions. The Copernicus program is very important for Europe and for the world. Uh, first of all, the Copernicus program is providing free data to everyone at any place in the world. So many users, not only in Europe, but also in America, in Asia, are using our data in a very large scale and very significantly. So therefore, Copernicus is really monitoring the health of our planet from all dimensions. The atmosphere, the, the oceans, the land surface, the ice caps, and this whole system of, of the Earth composed of these components is monitored constantly with Copernicus and therefore it is really important to see what is the state of our planet and how it, it will uh, evolve in the future. With Copernicus, ESA and the European Commission provide scientists, policy makers and ordinary people worldwide with a priceless insight into their own environment and how they might make our planet better for all.